Alright, nandito po tayo ngayon sa Station 1 kung saan po napadaan tayo dito sa bar restaurant ng Cas Bar, no? It is it has a really good ambience, no? Parang nasa Morocco. <laughs> Ayun, so timing talaga na gutom na gutom na ako. No? And by the way, this is the episode 3 of our food hacks. No, alamin natin kung ano ba ang kanilang top 3. Uh, best dishes. Ayon. So, makakasama po natin ngayon yung aking co-host. No? At siya po talaga yung mag-scrutinize. Wow! Uh, magtitikim ng pagkain, kakausap po sa uh, may-ari no? nitong uh, gas bar. No? So, indros ko na po kayo sa aking co-host. Walang iba kundi si Mr. Eugene Flores. Ayon! Yes, magandang gabi sa inyo lahat and welcome to Casbar Boracay. So we are here on our episode 3 of Food Hunt wherein we are going to interview the owner Miss Erlene. So tonight, titignan natin ano ba ang pinakamasarap na pagkain dito. Top 3 yan na best sellers nila dito and it goes with the drinks at kung talagang it, bakit nga ba dinadayo ang Casbar dito sa Station 1. Kung saan ang ambience ay Moroccan. So tonight, we are lucky enough uh, to present to you the owner of Caspar Barangay, Miss Erlene. Hi, Ma'am Erlene. Magandang Hi, gabi sa'yo. Hello. And pleased to Hi. meet you. Nice meeting you. So, okay. this is our third episode for Food Hunt, kung saan we're hunting all the restaurants in Barangay. And to give idea also to all, all our guests, especially season is coming. So, uh, we'd like to ask Ma'am, what made you inspire to, to make a, a restaurant that is totally different, like it's Moroccan setting, something like that? Okay, so let's start with the story that now this is Casbar Boracay, but before this used to be Caspa. Oh, okay. So this has been here Rene. for, for yeah, para rebranding. Mm -hmm. So this has been here since I think 2012, and then around 2020, um, during the pandemic, um, my husband is looking for something to do. Um, or a business here on the island and then ayun nga, um, may nagsabi na, na the owner is uh, selling it na because, because uh, she is already going out of the country and then so we were able to buy it and then, and then we have a few partners here and then so the rebranding na lang kami, we changed it into Caspar. Yeah, yeah. It you said earlier it is initially called Caspa. It's called Caspa with the H. It. Yeah, and, and you now you it it's Caspa. Okay. So uh, the re the inspiration is it's still the same. Caspa is Caspa and Caspa now is the same food, Moroccan food, Moroccan inspired. But of course, we um, newly improved it. So, but, uh, I'd like to ask uh, about the inspiration of of the food. As you said, uh, it was carried, carried from the previous uh, name, right. and then, but you rebranded. So, did you introduce another kind of food or you just improved the, the menu that they had before? Okay, so actually we improved some of it, the, the kebabs, the jeans, the hummus. But of course, we have our own, ver we, we did our own version of it. Um, so now, yung kami yung gumawa mismo na mabenta is the spicy chicken wings. Um, and also the pinakang patok talaga is the um, Moroccan pita pizza. It's a vegetarian um, with cream cheese, with cream cheese and spinach. Wow, those are top, later. Yeah, that, those are top two. So actually, we're looking for top three. So top what, three? Do you have uh, the third uh, one? The third one? Um, I think 
let me let me think ah oh the tagine eh sorry the fish tagine mahi mahi siya and then so we made our own version a fish version so this means is yes. really entirely different and then you just improve them yes definitely now uh, where did you source the, the ingredients of this uh, kind of food okay so because um, I know we're in the islands so. yes of course um since Mostly Moroccan food has like um, spices. We source it in Manila. So there is this um, there is this company there called, called Savory Blends. So uh, Moroccan mga Moroccan spices sila doon. So it's where we source it. And then uh, on the yung mga meat namin, actually we are halal. Mm-hmm. Halal food. We serve halal food. We are not certified, but we have halal food. So there's a local. Um, local na nagano. So, so usually, the shipment is around like you order ahead of time. We usually order like parang I think what we did last year is we 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 got a truck and we put everything there, even our even our um, mga spirits, mga alcohol. Ma'am, you mentioned the first. Uh, top seller is what's the name again? Top seller is, of course, first hummus, mm-hmm. second is the kebabs, mm-hmm. uh, chicken kebab, and of course the lamb tagine because we serve lamb here. So, in one particular menu, ma'am, uh, why is it named as such? Like, uh, bakit pinangalanan yun na menu na ng menu na ng ng pagkain ayon? Was there something about that, or you named it after? From your kids or somebody else? I ah, know it is really the name of the that name. dish. Okay, yes. okay. So that's the inspiration. That's that's a, the that's a, yes, it's inspiration. Like get... the tagine is like mm. a real tagine. It's really mm. from Morocco. The mm. kebabs is really called called kebabs. Mm. So ito yung parang binarbecue. Oh, okay. But then, oh, yeah. but then their version it's called kebab. Yeah. And then for the Moroccan pita pizza, kami lang like kami lang gumawa nun. <laughs> because uh, sabi ko, I, I wanted I want I wanted like a a pizza na, na pero ang ginamit namin is pita, pita so pita bread. so pita bread yeah so, so it's entirely different because we yes. usually know what pizza is yes yes but this time Ibang it's dough. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and then mom um why this top three are became best seller like for example for now we have different types of guests we have filipinos we have europeans so um this top three menu that you mentioned why it became best seller Sarap siya talaga. <laughs> and then sa kasa kaya yun yung mga pinakang kilala na mm-hmm. food. Hummus, number one yun. Oh, kilala na nila yun. Yeah, I know there are food bloggers yes, that comes uh-huh. here and then they posted also some yes. reviews about the food. Correct. Okay. Yes. Now, uh, when we uh, mentioned about the food, sometimes it goes with the drinks. Yes. Do you have any particular, like for this food, this is the, the equally partner drinks for this kind of food? May it be... Um, juice or wine or something like that. Yes, so um, I think for the kebab, the, the since meat siya, um, okay siya with sangria. Mm-hmm. So it is something like mixed with um, a little bit of wine with yeah. some spirit fruits. and fruits. Yeah. All right. But last question. I'd like, I'd like to ask this one because Christmas is coming, holiday season is coming. Do you prepare some menus, especially for that particular season, or it will be just the same menu that you're offering right now? Actually, it's gonna be the same menu, but we are going to launch our one one new dish. Pina perfect pa kasi. It's not easy na mag mag labas ng yes. ng bagong yeah. ano ano. It goes with the food. Yeah, testing. costing pa, etc., etc., and kung masarap pa, and kung patok pa sa mga tao. So, uh, I think by December 1 or onward, i-launch namin yung lamb chops. Wow. Kasi That's lamb chops. Lamb chops, yes. That's really good for, for holidays. Yes, right? definitely, especially, right? Yeah, especially <laughs> European people are coming, aside yes. from the Filipino tourists that we have yes. here. So, it's a good... Um, um, point for you to, to introduce another one, especially for the coming month. Yes, correct. Because actually, there there was this one customer that suggested it, and I'm like, okay, why not? And then, one of our pioneers here, Arnel, 
I asked, I, I, I told him, hey, why don't we do lamb chops? And then sinabi niya nga na, ah, before, dun sa Casba pa, meron na daw sila lamb chops. So, sinayar niya yung ingredient, and then, syempre, mas pinasarap pa namin. <laughs> so, Ma'am Early, do you have, like, the usual suke or kiss that keeps on coming back? Because they really love the the food here. Yes, definitely. Of course, locals. Yeah. That's friends. what we have. Yes, locals, yeah. friends, mm -hmm. and there are really people that, you know, that loves to stay in Discovery and that they're, all, they're always yeah. here. They're from like, Discovery you know, to the ambassador. The ambassador so to the land. Yes, so, yeah. talagang, hi, sometimes hindi ko na nga, parang nakalimutan ko na yung face, parang, hi, I said, oh, yeah, I met you last summer. And then, because so, it goes so, with the promotion yeah, also. So right? so Just by word. Yeah, so nakakatawa na bumabalik talaga sila because of the food, the vibe, the service, and of course the happy hour. Buy one, take one. Yes. <laughs> From 1 to 7 p.m. For only 220 pesos, it's like um, buy one, take one na ng cocktails. So Ma'am Erlin, we'd like to to invite you to please promote your restaurants and invite people to come over and um, taste the very good food that you offer. Okay, guys. So, hi, guys. So, once again, we are Casper Boracay. Uh, we serve Moroccan food here in the heart of Station 1. Um, each front, we have the best sunset spot to offer you during during sunset. <laughs> and, um, yes, the, as I said earlier, the buy one, take one on cocktails. And, of course, enjoy our Moroccan food. Um, it, it is authentic. Plus, we have the... Uh the singer here. Yes, yes, yes. So, um, the acoustic so, one. Yeah, yeah, acoustic. So, every Tuesday, we have the karaoke night. Si RM, nakapunta na yan dito. We'd love to do that. <laughs> nagdala na siya. Nagdala na siya yeah, ng yeah, magaling yeah, yeah. na singer. We'd love to do that. Uh, Wednesday, we have Inel. She's a DJ. She's a local DJ. On Thursday, we have Art Strong to do some reggae acoustic. Uh, on Friday, we have Pep Mayor for some hip-hop. And then Saturday, we have uh, DJ Heat Pow and uh, DJ Archie. And of course, on Sunday, um, Sunday all day happy hour. Uh, all day happy hour. All day Would love happy to hour, do that. guys. <laughs> it's all happy we, hour. Yes, we have DJ Marv and DJ Justin. So, Casper really never ran, run out of yes, uh, definitely. Um, promotions like yes, this. Yes. So, Mom Erlin, thank you so much for inviting us over. And of course, we will be helping you to, to promote Casper Boraka. And thank you for the food yes. that you prepared to us. Thank you so much, Eugene. And thank you so much, of course, KKK and all So, happy to be here. Alright, napakaganda ng usapan ninyo ni Miss Erlyn kanina, no? Na, well, the very purpose of this food dance talaga para sa ating mga tourists, to help the tourists kapag pumunta sila dito sa Boracay, especially when they are here at Casbah, alam na nila kung ano yung top 3 na dapat nilang orderin. Yes, at dami ng food kasi na Yes, at kagandahan dito, matitikman natin ito ngayon. Pero, Ano nga yun? Sir Eugene, na-review nga natin. Ano yung top 3 na yun? Well, kanina pinag-usapan natin. Isa sa pinaka um, top 3 ko ay ang hummus. Wow, hummus. So, uh, This top goes with the hummus. 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 Ay, kailangan talaga. Yeah. Intonation. The, the pronunciation hummus. is different. Yeah. Hummus. Okay, <laughs> number 2. That goes with chickpea, tahini, and olive oil. Wow. Okay. Ano ang pangalawa? Pangalawa, we have Moroccan veggie pita pizza. So this is pizza, but this one is entirely different because it, because it has pita bread. Yes. Oh, right? the yung, one that's not usually that we have. Yung pita ba yung pita na kinakain? Oh, yes. Pita. <laughs> pita talaga. <laughs> okay. Okay. Pangatlo. Pangatlo. Miss Erlin. The kebabs. Oh. The kebabs. Oh, I love kebabs. Yeah, when you, you speak know, of the vegetables, usually, right? Yes. Yes. But, wow. But, I love ano, it. Ano? Ang ipapaserve ko is the prawns, tiger prawns. Kefta, oh. kofta, kefta, and also the chicken kebab. So we're wow. also learning how to pronounce correctly the Moroccan. Yes. yes. Yun ang kagandahan, no? Yeah. Okay. So ulitin natin, kebab, yun ang last. <laughs> yung last talaga. And we have Moroccan veggie pita, pizza, yeah. okay. and hummus. Hummus. Okay, hummus. So, tikman na natin, tawagin na natin yung... Yeah. Anong unang isa-serve? Hummus. Ikaw, ikaw, ikaw mag-pronounce. Hummus. Yeah. Okay. First dish. One of the top. You know, yeah. Hummus. 
Ayun, tawagin na, Sir Eugene. Waiter, pasta. Come on, Joe, our pasta. Hi, ma'am, sir. Uh, this is our hummus. Uh, enjoy your food. Hummus? Hummus. Ah, hummus. hummus. Iba-iba talaga eh. Oo. Oh. Depende sa tao kung sino nag-pronounce. Pwede ba? Hummus or hummus. Oo, oh, dapat ititrain pa talaga ito sa pag-pronounce mo lang. Yeah. Baka iba food yung masaserve. Yeah. Let's try this one. Ayun, Sir Eugene. Come on. You know, ma'am, ano ito, ma'am? Uh, this food comes with what drink na pwedeng i-partner dito? I don't drink a bit. <laughs> oh, okay. We can choose any. So, we just choose any. Okay. And try the sauce. And then, you have to dip the sauce. Yes. Be generous. Wow. Like this, generous. So guys, huwag niyong kalimutan ha. Kailangan kamay eh. Mm. How was it guys? How was the bread? How was the pita bread? I love it's pita homemade. bread. Homemade. The pita bread is a big deal. Mm. Wow. How mm -hmm. was it? Sarap. Super good. So, yun pala, kapag kumain to ng hama, kailangan hummus. Kam hummus. Kamayin. Dapat kamayin. Mm -hmm. no? Hindi pala, ano-ano tayo ng ano. No, minsan talaga, no one is perfect. Mm. Especially so, guys, when you try it. You're gonna Food enjoy that the, they usually you're gonna you enjoy eat. the hummus here at Casbar Boracay. Wow. So. Wait, so bago tayo mabalik magbila upan. <laughs> okay, game. So, pwede natin ipaserve ang aming well-known na sangria. Mm. So, this is the um, so red and white sangria. I am just going to have an apple juice. Wow. Sangria, the well-known Sangria of Caspar. Hi, yeah. hey, Mom. How is uh, apple shape for you? Uh, I serve this one, the uh, white Sangria. Oh, mm. fine. Uh, this one, sir, uh, red Sangria. Red oh. Sangria. Thank you. Enjoy Thank your you. drinks. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Cheers to good life. Mm. Yeah. Good food, good life. Oh, I try it. This goes with the dry orange. Love it. Alam mo na miss ko yung uminom ng ganito. Hindi na ako nakakainom ng ganito kasi parang pag uminom ka nito, parang so, na. sosyalan ka. So, na. No? so thank you for letting me try this one. Okay. Hmm? So, na-try na natin yung hummus. Yan. Hummus. Hummus. Right. Alam niyo talaga kung ano paano i-pronounce ha? Yeah. <laughs> Kasi baka iba yung serve. <laughs> okay. Okay, we just had the hummus. Now, for our second dish, we will be having the Moroccan veggie pita pizza. Yes. Awesome. Favorite. Hi, ma'am. So, this is uh, Moroccan vegetable pizza. And I will take a torch if you like. Yeah. Yes, please. Let's torch it. What? Wow. With a torch. That's how you do it here. Mm -hmm. Wow, very interesting. Wow. This is entirely different pizza than we usually eat. Yes. So this is with cream cheese and spinach. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, ma'am, sir. Enjoy your pizza. Thank you. Thank you. So do the honor man <laughs> to hide its life. Go ahead, go ahead. Yeah, especially made for for this particular. Um, yeah, pizza. so this one is called Teresa. So this is a Harisa. bit spicy. Mm -hmm. I love spicy. Try to do. Do I have it to be generous? Ah, that's what I'm saying. Not for this. Yeah. Anyway, try this one. We'll try this one. It's so cheesy. It's so cheesy. So, Mr. Eugene, what can you say about our pita pizza? Winner ba? Winner because this is the first time I am happy to taste the cheese that you use now. Cream cheese. Mm -hmm. That is cream cheese. Cream cheese and then this one. And then, this, and then a regular cheese. Yeah. 
This is a spinach. Yeah, that's spinach. Okay. And then, ang ganda kasi kinotorch pa, no? It, it really attracts the the gas pa ba? Wow. Kasi iyon naman yun kung hindi ka kaiba kung hindi mo ino ano innovate yeah. yung services mo, wala ka rin eh. There's something to look forward to because you usually never see this one. Yes. In the, in the typical pizza parlor. Yes, so, you're right. It's really great. And it's really yeah. I'm having fun. And um ang kagandahan also uh, the 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 staff explain like ito na yung pizza mo and then that tira tatanungin ko rin if you're gonna torch it or not. So it's your it's your option too. You know? Napaganda. So ma'am, uh, what inspires again why you made this a uh, very um, ano ba to? delicious pizza with a torch. Wow. Okay. So actually it started it started when when I said I want something I wanted to cater more for vegetarian. Mm. Oh uh, especially at this pandemic. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah, yes, yeah. Yes. Um I'm a pescatarian, so uh -huh. I'm gonna eat meat. Mm -hmm. So what I am vegetarian. Na, na pizza. Mm. Uh, so um, our manager before says yes, suggest nya na mayroon. This is our own version. Eh. The merong pizza, ang the merong mga pizza. Pero sabi ko sige, why don't we try this? Kaya yon. So that's why we made this one. And yun sa pag torch naman, idea ko yun. So let's torch it. Then uh, let's torch it sa harap ng customer because I want it to be like something Instagramable, something so, right, 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 right. something na. Because it's so much better. Because it's so much better. Because there's like crunchiness that happens with the cheese. Yeah. Correct. Yes. So that's it. And yun nga. Grabe no yung mga in, in the businesses. Sa talaga minsan the personalized yeah. ang gusto ng mga may ari. And they should also innovate because you know the competition is so tough. So you yeah. really have to make something out special from your dish that the customers cannot see it from others. Yeah. Ano ulit yung anong pangalan nito? Um, Moroccan, Moroccan veggie, veggie pita, pizza. Ano yeah. utal ako? So sa mga ano dyan, no? sa mga uh, vegetarian, no? may pizza na po dito sa may gas bar, burakay na. Tinotorch sa harap mo, very crunchy and the cheese, I really like it. Plus of course the spinach. Mm. Yes, the spinach. And how about the harissa? Actually, the harissa um, sauce. Ito ang magpapagana sa akin. Uh, spicy siya. siya. Yeah, because a little, well, not really so spicy, but a little bit. Maybe uh, used na ako sa spicy. <laughs> don't put generously. Harissa kasi is a well-known na parang chili paste nila sa, uh -huh. sa country nila. Yeah. So most of the condiments are imported also. Of course, are, it has uh -huh. spices, yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. yeah. And you source it also all the, all the way from Manila? Yes, all the way from Manila. So we don't have it in Calibo, in the Indo. Before the they, we get in Calibo, mm -hmm. but then now we found someone from Manila. Wow. Good source from Manila. Yes. Okay. Was it? Do you encounter some uh, um, difficulty on the ship delivery? Yes, delivery. Yeah, delivery. Yeah, no matter. So you just ordered it ahead yes. of time. Well, it's yes. it's all about forecasting. <laughs> It's for all, all about forecasting. Yeah, especially like, we are on the island. And by the way, it blends to the uh, yeah. red. It blends to your red. Yeah. It blends yeah. to yeah. my yeah. white. Yeah. Mm. It's good. I think it's, we are ready to, to have, have the third menu. Mm -hmm. this, this is your main. Kebabs. <laughs> Kebab. Yeah. This Kebab. is your main. Then. Yeah, because Moroccan restaurants usually have kebabs. kebabs. So you cannot find Moroccan restaurant without kebabs, right? Yeah. So, that's the best seller to be at. Okay, tawagin na natin. Yung... Okay, for our final top three dish, presenting to you, kebabs. Pakipaso. Manjar. Hi, ma'am, sir. Please, yes. our kebab. Uh, this one, uh, Tiger prawns, kefta, uh, the minced beef, Kepta. and also the shista wolf, the chicken kebab. Mm -hmm. uh, for the sauce, we use for the garlic mayo for the kefta, the minced. Mm -hmm. And for the harissa, the spicy sauce, we use for the tiger prawns. Okay. And the charmula, you can use for this for the uh, shista wolf, for the chicken. Okay. Thank you. Very well Enjoy explained. your food. Thank you very much. And also the rice. 
Okay. To pair it with this one. So this rice is this one ada basmati rice. Basmati and uh, couscous. Couscous. All right. Very Cus -cus. healthy. Couscous. Cus -cus, yes. <laughs> So yes. it's really healthy, huh? Yeah. For those that are yes. enjoy your food, mom, sir. Thank you. Conscious about their health, yes. just early. Yes. Mom, one question: Can we interchange the sauce with one another, or is it like for prawns? Is just this, this is just for the prawns. Actually, these the two is good for anything. All right. Yes. So there's no specific. Sure, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can, you and can this taste one, it. This one because I don't eat meat, <laughs> so they. They, uh, they, they use it with the kefta. <laughs> mm -hmm. And it goes with the couscous yes. and the basmati rice. Yes. Yeah, I love basmati. RM, tara na! Come on, come on, come on, RM. Try, 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 try this one. And of course, we, as mentioned earlier, Moroccan restaurants will never be Moroccan restaurants without kebabs, right? This early. Yes. Mm -hmm. This is really, they're well known dishes. So, mm -hmm. they, how, how do you like the presentation? It's perfectly done, and I hope and I do really appreciate that the 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 and taste I of hope the it's <laughs> Yes, of and course. We always we already know Casper restaurant is in there. Your um, what they call this uh, expert in expert when when we say Moroccan food because you're the only Moroccan restaurants in the island, right? Yes, there's no other. There are lots of rest restaurants like Korean restaurants in the island, but definitely only one restaurant. About Moroccan dish. Moroccan in station one. Yes. It's also in station one. Right? And gusto ko rin i ano na, i in dito. Kasi nga, the place itself is really good. Kasi pag sunset, mas perfect place for sunset. Kasi harap na harap talaga sa beach niya. And then yung ano ah, yung buhangin, papunta sa tubig. Super fine. So, yeah, and pwede ka maglaro, pwede ka mag maligo, palito. Bulo -bulo siya. <laughs> and then alam mo, sa ibang mga hotels and rest, uh, hotels and resorts, na walang mga beachfront, I really recommend uh, Cass Bar Boracay to be here kasi nga, alam mo, hindi, nas, hindi ka naman sabihin na hindi safe, no? it's good na may, kapag may mga gamit ka, no? pwede mong ilagay dito sa restaurant pero siyempre, mag-order ka. Hindi ko hindi nagawin mo sa baggage area. No? Yeah. And, hindi ano, hindi ka... And aside from that, Cass Bar is surrounded with big hotels like we have here. Discovery Shores, another one here is the yeah. Ambassador. So it's really, yeah. you capture the you know, Ambassador, Floor, and um, you capture the market and, for good people who love to eat, right, Miss Erlene? Yes. yes. So we'll try this one. Come on, guys. Okay. All right. All right. Wow. Good honor. You know, it's really good. Yeah. You know, I'm going to go to the other side. I'm going to go to the other side. Okay. Go with the This is couscous and this is the spati. How do you eat this, Miss Lynn? Ah, okay. 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 Oh. Alright, oh. oh, go now. Dapat dito sa Sir Al. Yes, yeah, Sir Al. Al. Sorry. Shout out to Dr. Al. Shout out to Dr. Al. Oh nga, Dr. Al. Okay. Come on. Ano nga yung perfect nun? Yes. The sauce that is... That's Charmula sauce. Mula. Charmula. 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 Ulit? Char 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 Charmula. <laughs> Di ba ang hirap? Oh, ito ito ka. Ang hirap niya yung pornas. Pero masarap. Ganun daw talaga. Pag mahirap i-pronounce, masarap daw yun. Forget your rice, guys. Ah, yeah. Okay. Try the pasmati and the lasagna. Mm -hmm. We'll try both. Alam mo, maano, malalasa mo yung aroma niya. Yung smell ng... Ng grill. Yeah, ng grill. Bro. 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 Sige, go ahead. I'll watch you guys. Ano pa? Ano yung comment mo? How was it? Super good. Aww, I love to I'm have. Really like, I'm, 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 I'm really happy that you guys. Guys, right, that's why you really have to be here and experience the good food that Casper Restaurant is offering. This is not just good for us locals, but also for the people who really love Moroccan food. So try. Actually, try it. I'm not gonna say. I'm not gonna say. I'm not gonna say. I'm not gonna say. Spices in the mouth and first in your mouth. So. And this is not the usual food that we have in the table. Yes. No. As, as, as we already said, this is a Moroccan dish. So sometimes we really have to, you know, eat other other food from other countries. What kind of rice? Is this couscous? Couscous. 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 couscous with the rice or other. Couscous is a type of rice. Yes. For mm -hmm. healthy people. <laughs> Instead of 
So you got plain rice? It is not for me. I'm not healthy. No, no. Okay, next. Next, you guys right. try the kefta. Actually, this is pronounced as from kofta, kefta, but... Is it the beef? Or? This is beef. Good. This is like minced beef. Okay, please dig in. Thank you so much. Tagayan yung yung Pinoy na, the like spit up ball. Was spit up ball. Yeah, was spit up ball. We are here, the island. Yeah, we are in the hospitality. Thank you, Miss Lin. Industry. So it's come. It comes with this sauce. The sauce is this one. What do you call it? Garlic mayo. Ani yan. Kami lang gumawa niya. Oh, by, the, by the way guys, I just wanted to share that we just actually also opened Casper Bacolod. Oh. This is our first fun time. Wow. So, uh, my husband is uh, Ilonggo, he's from Bacolod. So, he did it sa kanya hometown. Mm -hmm. So, this is operating now. This is operating now. We're very, very busy Which part of the No, Bacolod. Oh, Bacolod. Uh, um, it's in Paseo Verde. It's in Sabisma, Bacolod. It's not the usual food. I'm not saying I'm yeah. a because we are in front of the camera, okay? I'm saying I'm a because that's my, my honest. Um, I think, and also we have people around. Yeah. So usually, Miss Erden, your guests are not limited to locals only or Filipino tourists who also have people from other countries, especially European yes. countries, right? Actually, most of the foreigners are They are They usually see us, because I usually ask them, I usually go around like, ah, how did you know about us? Mm -hmm. They usually said that um, from, from Google reviews, mm -hmm. that the other way. Because there was a time that we were number two. Mm -hmm. Like 4.6 Wow. And then Chief Advisor the other day, like Zero? vegan, vegan kasi siya. So we have like, mm -hmm. and of course, halal. If you research halal, we have many Muslims that live here. So wow. The brothers and sisters around. Mm -hmm. Nice. Because actually, when, when, especially in the hotel, if you're working in the hotel, most of the people who love to eat would, would, would ask the front office. What are the top 10 best restaurants in Thailand? I would always tell them, please Google it. Yes. Or try to, to check out with the TripAdvisor. And you can find. Yeah. And El Caspar is there. Definitely. But now I'm going to say, if you Google Caspar, it will guide you to Caspar <laughs> location. It's easy. Caspar. Okay, let's proceed to the next. Proceed now. Ooh, I'm going to eat this one. I love this one. This one is the tiger prawn. This is tiger prawn. So once again, and the thought from your love. Eh, sorry, Harisa. 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 So Miss Arlen, you don't you know don't stop from innovating your menus because you keep on you know yes, improving it or searching something that is really suitable to to, to, the, to the needs of your customers, right? Yes. Of course, that's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, you never stop. No, you never stop searching. And the guests would always find time to say, especially wow. those that are that have not been here for second time, third time, fourth time. The, you know, the consistency yes. in the food that you offer. Yeah, you like to say sa to your chef's time. Consistency. Mm -hmm. That's a big deal. Yeah, because I don't want it to happen. Uh, you're going to eat here one time. And they're going to eat here at the first, and then it's going to be super good. And then, you're going to eat here at the first. And then, you're going to eat here at the first. And then, you're going to eat here at the first. And then, you're going to Second, yeah. third, fourth, yeah. multiple times that you are going to come here yeah. and eat yeah. the food. And at that to return here. Mm -hmm. yes. But to recommend word of the mouth, the, the before, rule of ten. The one comes here for the first very first time and then uh, uh, Mr. Lee, we would we would invite more. Ano tawag ulit dito? 
Harissa. 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 Ato ang ito, nakakatulong, no? And it helps to our, ano, no? To our uh, tourists, uh, especially sa... Pag nandito sila sa Boracay, pag pumunta sila sa Caspar, ang top three na dapat nilang i-order, una una ay yung kebab. Hamal. <laughs> <laughs> Moroccan uh, vegetable. Pizza. Pizza. Ano? Pizza, pizza. Pizza, pizza. Pizza, pizza. And? Hamas. 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 So, yun po, no? Um, sige, magpapaalam na muna ako sa ating mga bisita, no? Sa lahat po, no? We are in the episode 3 of our food hands, no? The top 3, no? We are here at Caspar Boracay, no? If you Google Caspar Boracay, it will show, no? It will show the their account or their website, their Facebook, Instagram, yes. TripAdvisor, and you will see also good reviews, no? So I would like to invite everyone to come and visit uh, Casbar Burangay, all right? I really, I'm really sure you're gonna enjoy it. Okay? Super. So, sa lahat po ng mga nanood, by a PCTV Burangay, um, that is channel one and channel 19, ACTV Aklan, that is channel six, and of course, it is also live at your Burangay, guys. So, don't forget to click like and follow and share, okay? So, Yay. see you. Ma'am, salamat po. Salamat po. Salamat, sir, you just salamat. Thank you, thank you po. Thank you. Thank you po. Thank you, PCTV. a lasting impression on your clients with the new way to present yourself. 10K Cards, the modern approach to business cards. No longer will you have to worry about losing your business card or wear and tear. 10K Cards is the central point of your networking. From WhatsApp to Instagram to LinkedIn, provide people with the ability to connect with you like never before from one central hub. Get instant access to your own landing page that has everything users and clients need to engage with you. 10K Cards let customers pay you with Zelle, Venmo, or Cash App. Book an appointment with your booking system, provide directions to your address, add links to your products, and much more. Anyone with a smartphone camera is able to scan your customized Q code to get an immediate access to your card. Users and clients are able to save you as a contact in their phone book directly from your digital card. Better yet, users can save your card directly to their home screen and always have direct access to you at a moment's notice. Get 10K Cards, your revolutionary digital business card.